Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. I'm Dear Darling, as you'll see what's going on on a lovely island, Fawn Hollow, today, where we are not. I don't know, can I? I don't think I can particularly continue on um, with um, the holiday arc. There's not really much else to properly say. Well, actually, I have just thought of a topic I could talk about, you know, uh, because it's marvelously relevant to what I was doing a little bit earlier, but we'll get onto that for a second. I suppose the first thing to get out of the way is my, my throat might sound a little bit weird, because if it feels like I've got the start of a sore throat coming on, but I'm not actually sure, you know? You, you know you're in that weird period where you're just like, am I getting ill? Or maybe I just didn't drink enough water today. I did drink a lot of water today, but maybe my throat's just tired. I don't know. Sometimes it happens. Hopefully I'm not sick, but you know, I, well, I guess you'll find out sooner or later. Uh, good evening, everyone. Right now in Fawn Hollow, it's 9.13pm on Thursday, September 29th, 2022. Uh, so we're visiting our campsite. Actually, thinking about it, it's been a very long time since I've been ill. Because if I'd been ill, I probably would have stopped. I probably would have not recorded an animal. No, wait, maybe I, maybe I have gotten ill and just recorded an Animal Crossing episode anyway. That sounds like something I might do. I don't know. If that is the case, you'll probably see tomorrow of like a five minute long episode or something, which I probably shouldn't even record in the first place if I'm super, super ill, but um, we'll see how it goes. My throat is just certainly a little bit tired. I was going to record some Amari today and I was like, there's no way I'm going to be able to record like an hour session of like reading out story with my, my throat just being like blah today. So, you know, that, that was a hard pass. But now what I'm going to talk about today, which is... I don't really know as much of a basis of a conversation, but it's like music players. I don't know really, really how to sort of describe it, but you know, it's a classic thing, you know, to do while traveling is to listen to music or on holiday, you know, on the plane. Um, I was gonna say AirPods in, I don't have AirPods. Yeah, here I am, I'm still a scrub, I'm still using wired earbuds. You might be like, what brand do you use? I don't actually know, I, they might be, ang no, but they're not, for some, I used to use Panasonic ear, um, earbuds. Um, I can't remember what brand, they were like HL, V something, somewhere along those lines, I don't know, they're very basic, they were less than £10, they're very cheap and you know, uh, I, I basically went through three of them in my lifetime from the start of whenever I started using earbuds, which I don't know, it must have been whenever I got my phone, I can't really remember, it's been a very long time, uh, to the end, and then um, uh, more recently my, my previous earbuds, were, they, were, they were actually broken for a while, the same sort of Panasonic ones and maybe a more modern brand, uh, a modern make, I can't, model, I can't remember, but um, I was gonna go buy the Panasonic ones again, and I was like, wait, hold up. I should probably at least try to buy some actually decent <laughs> um, earbuds now, you know? Something that will last me maybe like five, six years rather than, you know, like two or three years or something, because um, even though I don't use earbuds particularly often or that sort of thing, um, it, it would be a good idea at least to, you know, have a, have, have a good pair. And you might be like, why don't you use them particularly often? Well, when I'm at home, um, I use a headset, like uh, over-ear headphones and that sort of thing, because that's, you know, what I'm, I use my computer. My computer is what I use most of the time recreationally at home. And um, if I get the op option to, I would just use these headphones. You might be like, what headphones are they? They're DT7, uh, hold on, DT770 Pro, I think? DT770 DT Pro. I believe that's Audio Technica uh, as a brand. And I'll, I'll use that, I'll use that like um, when I'm playing piano and I'm plugging headphones in. I'll, I'll use these headphones to plug it in. Um, if anything, I should get two of these so I can have like one on the go and one um, at home. But you know, that obviously makes no sense whatsoever, so I'm not going to do that. Um, I don't have that much money to spare because these headphones are expensive. They're like £80 or something, I think. Um, that might not be true, I don't remember. Mm, check the price yourself. But anyway, yeah, these are very good headphones. So I basically never use earbuds at home. Um, but you know, of course, having uh, the fact my earbuds. Pre oh, hold on, I can't, I think, can't think how to phrase the sentence. I never used them at home, I only used them when I was out. So when I w went out, the fact my earbuds were broken didn't really bother me too much because I didn't use them for very, for very long or that sort of thing. But it was it was only like, no, it was a couple of weeks ago, maybe, maybe like a month ago, I was like, I should just get some good earbuds or something, you know. What's the point of me using these broken ones? There's literally no point of like me tr still trying to use those ones when I can ma spend maybe like £20 or something and get some decent earbuds. You might be like, why don't you get um, some wireless earbuds, you know, AirPods, um, Big Sur, or like um, an Android equivalent because you don't have, you don't use um, Apple products. Not, not that much out of spite or anything, it's just like I've used Android for all my life, so you know, everything, uh, but basically everything I use kind of tied to, go to, tied to Google, so you know, the same way that people are like stuck with um, iPhones and that sort of thing because they use Apple, I'm kind of stuck with like Google products because I've used Google, um, that's, not, that's not actually true, <laughs> I'm going to be honest, but I, I do like the Google Pixels because I like them as a mid-range sort of phone, um, or some of them, some, I don't know, so hit or miss some of them, but the Pixel 4a, pretty decent I would say. Um, and anyway, you might be like, why don't you get some wireless earbuds? I don't 
think I use earbuds enough to justify it. And I don't know, <laughs> like, but I, I'm not going to say I'm like a traditionalist when it comes to earbuds or something, but I guess it's sort of, sort of like the, the idea that I don't use earbuds enough, I feel like, to justify using wireless ones. And like, I don't know, I just know, like, since I've never picked up wireless head, um, earbuds, headbuds, um, I've never been like, wow, this is game, I've never had that, wow, this is game changing moment. And um, I had to use these all the time. Like all my friends have like wireless earbuds. I'm gonna be honest, it's, it's basically just me still using the wired ones. Um, but that's because I just don't use it all that often, you know? And I listen to music, but a lot of the times, it's gonna sound super strange, but I don't need to listen to music necessarily because I can, you know, just play the song in your head <laughs> or sing it out loud. That's how it goes for me. Um, or sing, sing out loud, of course not like in public transport, you know, play, play that in your head. Or sometimes I'll just, you know, go out and travel, I'll just sleep, you know, or I'll read something instead. Or, you know, I want to play a game, but, you know, I don't listen, need to necessarily listen, necessarily need to listen to the game audio. And you can't often play music on top of a game audio, which is, you know, a bit of a problem. Well, you know, I'll do X, Y, Z, you know, and um, music is just like, I don't know. I, I like music, don't get me wrong. It's just like, I don't know. I'm, I'm certainly not the, the average person when it comes to listening to music, you know, I listen to very specific things, like from things on my video games I like, things on, well, it was mainly just video games, I'm going to be honest, <laughs> or very specific things, like, I didn't, like, when Spotify was super popular, I, I basically, were, I was so late on my Spotify train, I've only started using it over, like, the past couple years, I think, like, maybe a year ago, or, or two years ago. I started kind of using it, and I only started kind of using it, it was because I wanted, at that time, I was like, I want to listen to K-pop songs, um, because that was um, kind of like the thing I was sort of jiving to, uh, and you might be like, do you listen to K-pop much anymore? No, not really, I'm going to be honest, um, I'm sure part of the reason is the fact that two of my, <laughs> my favourite groups broke up, or I don't know, maybe like broke up, that makes it sound bad, but it's more like they just like stopped operations, <laughs> okay, that's just such a mechanical robotic way of speaking, but you know what I mean, we stopped making music. And also I just sort of feel out of paper. It's very much a university sort of thing. Um, I'm not saying um, K-pop is bad or anything. I, I still think it's quite nice. I just don't listen to it all that much. So that's why I use Spotify for it. Um, and now I use Spotify um, for some of the music. You know, like lo-fi chill beats. I use that instead of a YouTube stream. And you might be like, whoa, you don't use a YouTube stream? You don't use uh, hip-hop lo-fi beats 24-7 to relax slash study to or whatever it's called? You know, that, that was popular back when I was in secondary school, which is wild to think about. Um, and I listen to it sometimes, but I never actually used it. But, you know, listening on Spotify feels a lot more convenient than, you know, having it open on YouTube, I feel like, a lot of the time. So, I don't know, that sort of appealed to me. And it's also, you know, if, if you see my art time lapses, I, I basically use music from there most of the time, unless I need something very thematic, in which case I'll go to Kevin MacLeod. Um, is this? No, but, okay, I was going to be like, is this a Star Fragment Island? It's not a Star Fragment Island, because there's no cliffs. Um, but yeah, so I've, I've been very late on my Spotify train, which is, I don't know, I, I mean... If you would talk to me, you know, if you would get my opinion, you'd be like, what do you think about music? I'd be like, I love music, you know, I love, <laughs> but the more I think about it, I'm like, maybe I just like the idea of music. I don't actually listen to music all that much. Like, I don't listen to pop music um, all that often. You might be like, oh yeah, okay. You, you might be like, yeah, I don't listen to it either. I like more, you know, indie things or things like that. I don't really listen to that either. Like, and, and you were like, what do you like, listen to rock music or like metal? I'm like, no, not really. Like, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't know any like current rock bands or metal bands or whatever like I, I know names I don't really know who they are I don't know I just do I just not listen to music I mean that's just I, I, I do listen to music I listen to a lot of time video game music sometimes but even that I don't listen to that all the time I'm gonna be honest I only listen to that when really I'm passing time and and normally on travel I only listen to it when it's like I'm going to sleep and I will put like music on in my ears and just go to sleep unless it's uncomfortable because sometimes it is and then I just take them out you know <laughs> I guess I'm oh, I'm bothered Look at me, not bothered. As he, as he, um, oh, what, what's that? What's that called? Catherine Tate, I think. Um, reference for you there. Um, <laughs> I forgot what I was saying. Anyway, music plays and that sort of thing. Anyway, but, but, this was relevant because I've got to say, if any of you out there using Windows computers and you're using Groove Music, Groove Music is terrible. <laughs> I want to like it so much because I like the interface, you know, displaying the album, it's something like that, and then something small or whatever, and I like how it displays on your volume mixer um, when you're playing when you're playing music, but it sucks at taking metadata. Like, all, most of the um, music I have is not, it's like video game music, or it would be like J-pop or something, you know, from like the anime games I play. 
and stuff like that. So the metadata is stuff like I all, I, I've put in myself or whatever. Um, it, it, it's not something which is it's very easy such a bubble on. Because um, what, what Groove Music does is, is it tries to fill in metadata by searching it up um, through like Google databases or what, um, what have you and filling, filling in what it can. But for whatever reason, it just doesn't work. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't even work with um, like your own downloaded music because all of the music I have is downloaded, you know, like the soundtracks which I bought and downloaded. Um, it just like doesn't recognize the metadata for whatever reason. So like every single song in my like music library is just unknown artist, unknown album. And it has a picture of a Cuphead um, album art. I don't know why. I, I have no idea why. It's just, it's so terrible. And you know, I've tried doing a lot of things, you know, I tried like re-indexing, re like reattaching and detaching my music folder. I've tried, what else have I tried? I think re-indexing was the, the main one, you know, opening up a media player and doing it, like re remaking the songs and it just, it just like overwrites things or whatever. And yes, I have turned off a setting to make it like, um, fetch information from the internet. It just, it just ignores all the metadata on the actual file itself. And, and I have no idea why it does that. If any of you have a proper solution, then please do let me know because I do want to use it. Anyway, so I was just like, earlier because I was downloading more music and like setting some metadata and I was like trying to get it to play in live groove and it was just like unknown artists again I was like okay thanks live groove um you know it's like if, if I ever wanted to you know have like a primordial soup of all the songs I've I guess melodic soup of all the songs I've ever gotten you know just hit shuffle and all of it and I guess you know live groove music has got me covered as has literally every other music interface in the world um but if I ever want to play like oh I want to play this album or I only want to play this artist groove music's like Nah, I don't know what you're talking about. Everyone's the same, and <laughs> like you know, uh, it's just it's just annoying. So anyway, I've I downloaded this new um, software called Music Bee, and which it was it's pretty recommended, and it 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 it's pretty sleek. It, it just works. It sorted everything automatically. It it came, it came up with like a couple of areas of the metadata where it randomly just like listed and as an album artist, um, but you can manually edit the things the, the way it um, recognizes songs. You know, in the actual interface itself. So there you go. <laughs> easily fixable you can delete things which I didn't want displayed like songs and I, I never listened to and that sort of thing being like I don't even know why I have this on here and other things which is like this is just sound effects I don't know why this is counts as music which live group is like yep that should be music um so yeah fantastic uh the only downside I was going to be like is it doesn't does it have a dark mood but select skin dark arsenic it just closed itself oh no it's reloading okay no I don't I don't like that I've got, I've got to find Dark Metro. And I, I like dark multicolored most of the time. Mm, Why they got Onyx, Pastel Green. Ultramarine Windsor? What, what does Metro style mean? Uh, no. I, I, I want it to be dark mode, you know, music B. Come on. Uh, one downside. But the skins. Find more skins? You can find skins online? Oh my god. Chameleon DNA skin, what on earth is going on? Kryptonite? Lunar Eclipse? Sting? Dracula? What else is going on? Okay, let's just use one of the defaults. Let's not, let's not overcomplicate things. Sex skin, dark, midnight metro. How about this? Okay, that seems pretty good. Close that for now. Um, anyway, so, you know, had to download a whole music player. And then, uh, I was, uh, I'm was i talking about this, and it's tangentially related to the holiday thing, because uh, on the phone, for whatever reason, and the, the, the Google, like, music player of choice has been, like, going through up and down, or wh whatever, you know, classic Google, pick up, you buy, purchase a new app, stop all development on it, people stop using it, and then be like, why, are no one, why is no one using this? We're terminating its um, existence, and it's like, what? But... You know, like back in the old days, so I can't remember what the app name was, but it was like an actual built-in music Android app. And then, you know, then, then it be I think it became Groove Music again. Then it, then it became Google Play Music. But now Google Play services are all like, they're all gone, I think, apart from books. And now you're meant to use YouTube Music. But YouTube Music, I'm going to be like, it's also not great. Because for whatever reason, um, when, whenever I go to my library, like all, all my music is like, on is on the device it's not like live music or anything and i'm i'm not that sort of person you know and i don't i don't well hold on <laughs> but it makes it sound very sort of like um dismissive that's not what i meant oh sorry snobby that's not what i meant um but like you know i, I don't use spotify when i don't 
because uh, when I'm not on my computer because you know I'm using my data to actually like listen to songs I'm like I don't have that much data let's conserve it uh, despite the fact I, like, I never use it up <laughs> um, every single month but still YouTube music for whatever reason every single time I click on my library I'm like I just want to see my device music I'm, I literally never go listen to any of the online music but every single time it fails to load it because it's like it, especially like when you're on the plane or something it's like I'm trying to trying to connect to like online services or whatever and like find the music or whatever I mean it just like doesn't load things I mean it's, it's, it's just like come on YouTube music I'm not even sure if I'm explaining myself properly basically like I click on library and rather than just immediately displaying um, all my music because that's what I want it go it just like loads forever it's like what are you loading <laughs> And my, my assumption is, um, through testing it, uh, is trying to connect to the internet to be like, oh, what if you wanted to listen to like a radio or something? Oh my god, I've literally never done that. Why would I want to do that? It's because there's two, there's two things. You click on something and it goes, YT music and device files, but it doesn't let you click on device files until, you know, the entire thing has loaded. It's very annoying. <laughs> anyway, um, so YouTube music, and also YouTube music, very very similar um logo to youtube studio i get them confused literally all the time I, and also i don't know why youtube music has a most bizarre logo like google is going a very weird direction of logos or basically putting everything in a white circle why i don't know i guess for clarity's sake some of it it works on like google photos that looks pretty good google assistant that looks pretty good and when you get some other weird ones you're like google playbooks that looks kind of weird <laughs> not gonna lie um, and like Google Files, the files could just be like an, its own thing. Like it doesn't need a circle behind it, I'm going to be honest. I don't... And also they use a very minimalist style, which I appreciate because I, I like minimalism. Oh, hello, Wisp. But I'm going to say Google Google Files and Google Wallet at a glance. I don't know which one's which. Is this one? This is Google Wallet. It used to be, I think it used to be called Google Pay, didn't it? Is it still called Google Pay? No, it's called Google Wallet. Because I, I always sort my apps alphabetically, so it's actually the wrong area. I've got to move it down. But I've got to say, YouTube Music is actually just insanity. Because YouTube Music is like already in. It's, it's it's a YouTube play button, a white play button on a red circle, surrounded by a white circle, surrounded by a red circle, surrounded by a white circle again. It's absolute insanity. Um, I guess what it's going for is, is technically it's meant to be the YouTube play white button in a white circle on a red circle that's probably what it's meant to be but then by putting another white circle on it it just looks like a load of concentric rings and it's like it's, it's actual insanity <laughs> that logo is there a way to like i don't know have a google ones not display like this i was even looking at slack for a second being like what google app is this and i was like wait where's slack <laughs> it looks like a, it's like a google app hold on because it's got the same sort of um it's got the same sort of thing no developer Slack technologies? Oh, Rowan, you're ill. Let's go get you some medicine. Let's go practice medicine. Um, so yeah, Google, I don't know what you're doing with your logo game. I'm going to be honest. It's it's not it's not cool. Yours is also completely ruining the vibe of um, my phone formatics, to be honest. This, this giant white circle totally ruins it. Oh, should we see who our, vista, um, our campsite vista is? I'm going to predict ooh, 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 Elmer. Just the first person who came to mind. Oh, Sky! Sky, you're adorable, but unfortunately, um, Fawn Hollow is full. But it's okay, we, we've got Sky on Happy Home Paradise anyway, so I can talk to her anytime we want. That's a good thing about Happy Home Paradise, I just pretend they're also just like, you know, extended residents of my island. I wish the people from Happy Home Paradise would visit your island sometimes on holiday as well, that'd be pretty awesome. Ah, I wish we were thinking for things which will, features which will never get implemented into Animal Crossing because, you know, they've kind of just left it as it is. <laughs> ah. You might, you might be like, are you sad? No, not really. You know, it's kind of what it's expected, to be honest. To, to have any other expectations at this point. And I, I bring up this conversation, like, all the time. It's, it's really pointless. No, no one cares about it. You know, I'm going to immediately drop it. If if you want the rest of our conversation, then I just, like, skip to a random episode in the past. You'll probably hear me talk about it for at least, like, five minutes. Uh, we're here to talk about music plays. I just, I don't know. I can't get on board with groove music. I can't get on board with YouTube music. Just bring back... J j j all I need is a generic thing to sort my albums correctly like look at my metadata and actually be like yes this is this this song is not an unknown artist it's this artist this song is not an unknown album it belongs to this album but that, that's all i need and so a music player just to do that you know saying that i wonder if music b's got a, a phone option <laughs> maybe i should just switch to that you know it's like google i've given you your chance just like 
you know, it's it's just like make it better. <laughs> it's so vague, but you know, it's like come on, you, you you've already got like, I mean, you, you've already got the most difficult step out of the way is like getting it in people's hands. It's the default app. Just like make it such that I want to use it over the other things. Ah <laughs> uh, well, you know, Google. Sorry, I guess they're not Google anymore. They're Alphabet, aren't they? But you know, I'm not gonna. I, like everyone else, is going to call them Google. Like, I'm not going to call them Meta Meta. I'm going to call them Facebook still. Um, oh, yeah, I forgot we were doing whispering. But first, let's, um, let's go give some medicine to Rowan. Then we have about five minutes to try and fix Wisp, which might be doable. I don't really know. <clears throat> um, so, Rowan's ill. I'm a little bit ill as well, maybe. Who knows? My, I, I gotta say, you know, I don't know if my throat sounds any different. My throat feels different when I'm speaking. It feels more scratchy. And I have no idea why I turned on this vacuum. I wish, you know, life was just a bit le like Animal Crossing. You're slightly ill. Take medicine. For just one dose of entire pack of medicine. I mean, it just... Um, I mean, it's just like, boom, you're cured. Simple, you know. Too bad life just wants to be difficult instead and you have to, you know... Actually recover, take antibiotics, take them for a full duration. That's a joke, by the way. Please do actually take antibiotics for a full duration. Um, it's kind of a point of them. Uh, I forgot what I'm doing. Oh, oh, a wisp, wisp, wisp. Uh, let us go capture some spirit pieces. Did this one just disappear? I don't really know. Nine. Did wisp appears after nine? I thought you appeared after eleven. <laughs> Clearly that's wrong because, you know, he's here, but it's just sort of, um, are you thinking? You are thinking. Moving away from his island, Ollie? Absolutely not. No, don't go. <laughs> I wonder how my four hollow residents feel for the fact that they're literally trapped here forever because I will never let them leave. Maybe at some point I should let them leave, you know, like... Fifth anniversary of Animal Crossing. Um, okay, I think it's a bit ambitious. Like, I'm still doing Animal Crossing for five years. I mean, what's a more achievable milestone? I guess day a thousand? I don't know. I kind of don't want to let my villagers leave. I'm going to be honest. You know, I've worked hard to get these villagers. I kind of want them to stay. I'll do the same thing I told you that I never would. You had excellent stay by Justin Bieber and the kid Leroy? I don't even know. Like, I only know that... Um, song because I heard it in like a random gif on the internet at some point and I was like this song slaps and it does slap I'm gonna be honest I'd be like it's one of my favorite modern songs but I also think it's like five years old now maybe no that's too old maybe y you hear that when I say no that's too old look my voice sounds different now, doesn't it it's like my deeper tones are getting deeper <laughs> Apologies a little bit for pause there, um, as we, what are we, oh, we're, we're hunting spirit for, uh, Mr. Wisp. <laughs> I feel like my brain's rattled, maybe I am ill. That'd be, that'd be a bad outcome. No, I didn't want to be ill. You know what, you know what, it's best cure to being ill, just, um, just being like, nah, I'm not. You're just powering through. <laughs> um, that's something from, I can't remember who it is, like, Gavin Free or something from... Achievement Hunter Rooster Teeth? I, I, don't, I don't really know which one's which, I'm going to be perfectly honest anymore, but um, I, yeah, I used to watch them a little bit. And I don't know, it's a very a very iconic sort of um, animated short here. Okay, hello. Um, hello, Scorpion. Let us just sort of... No! <laughs> right. Um, what happened to it? Maybe it lost interest? Eh? Despawn? Sorry about that, another pause again, but it has seemed like the scorpion just full on vanished? Alright, you know. <laughs> no big deal, I, I, I suppose. We're, we're just sort of out here hunting spirits anyway. We've got three of them. We've got two more. Uh, we've got about 30 seconds to find the next two um, before 25 minute timer is up, what well, is, um, timer, invisible timer, timer I've constructed in my head, but you know, I haven't recorded anything else for today, so you know, we can go on a little bit longer, 
It was more my fault for um, spending so long to actually find Wisp in the first place. I kind of forgot that Wisp would probably be here. Is he here every night? It's been so long since I've really thought about, like, NPC visitors, <laughs> villagers visiting. And I don't remember what, what determines um, their visits anymore. Um, what was that? Oh, yeah, music players. Uh, I don't know. I guess I can talk about, like, literal music players. I used to have an iPod video when I was very young. Basically never used it. Um, went to a Head Start University course, which is basically a taste of like university course when I was in year 13? No, it must have been year 12. I don't remember. Anyway, it was um, for computer science, which I didn't end up studying, so I, I, I don't know. Um, and I worked with a group on a project where we had to program anything, literally anything over the day. I did no programming, I just made art. And our team won <laughs> because, well, honestly, our, our team won because we had two amazing programmers. Me as an okay enough like designer, one fantastic team leader, and the other two were just you know pretty chill, but pretty like um what what's the word? Cooperative when it comes to team. We, we just had a good team going on <laughs> going in, but you know hard carried definitely by those two like fantastic programmers. I wonder if they're still programming now. I've never spoken to them since, but um. <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, we won. Got like an iPod Shuffle. You might be like, whoa, iPod Shuffle, that's great. No, it was not great. It could only hold like two gigabytes of songs. It was, it was very tiny, which to be fair, and you know, I guess the university didn't want to give out like a ma I'm not going to name any names, I'm going to be honest. No. I guess the university didn't want to give out like a massive prize or anything, but come on. Two gigabytes? That's like two albums. I don't know if that's true or not. <laughs> it might have been more than two gigabytes, but a lot of it was just the yeah, actual like, um, excuse me? Oh, my depth perception is just majorly balked, it turns out. Um, yeah, so I ended up never really using that. I don't know if I use my Apple video app either. Because back in those days, you know, those were the LimeWire sort of days that people got songs. You know, you, you might be like, no, this is the iTunes day where people got songs. Not if you were, like, 12. Um, but anyway, I was, I was really young, so <laughs> I didn't even know how to use the iPod, I'm going to be perfectly honest. I think my sister did it for me, or whatever, but, you know, I'm I never figured out how she did well okay obviously now i know how to that, like download songs with itunes about something but um so i basically never used it because i never figured out how to get songs onto it nor do i did i have songs to listen to <laughs> um so yeah i don't i don't really know maybe it's just been ingrained into me to never listen to music that's not true um something new of course we always go for something new we you know expense is not really a concern anymore for us but something new gives us something which we've never had catalogued i believe that's how the logic works for wisp um, but yeah, um, on that note, I'm going to round off this episode here, and hopefully I'm not ill come tomorrow, and if I am, well, it's going to be an interesting episode of Omori, I'll tell you that much. Actually, how much of a backlog do I have? I, th I think I might be safe for, for a little while for backlog, so probably probably enough time to recover from um, if I am ill. Let me see, let me see. I think I've got a backlog until next week, which is nice. Ooh, I don't have a big backlog. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, if you have been watching, thank you very much. It's been Animal Crossing New Horizons. I've been Dear Darling. Any likes, comments, subscriptions, shares are greatly appreciated. Join me in Dear Darling Discord. Follow me on Twitter down below. Hope to see each other again. But for now, it's our farewell. So until next time. Until next time. Bye bye for now. <laughs>